The High Potential Scheme for Health and Care is here to develop the next generation of diverse and inclusive leaders across the health and care system and beyond. And there's a crucial role you could play in coaching the very best talent to represent the diversity and passion of our workforce. As a careers coach, you'll support participants during the scheme with their personal and professional career development journey. You'll encourage them to grow as individuals, reach their professional goals and achieve their potential. And you'll play a key role in helping to develop inclusive leadership across the national health and care system. As a careers coach, you'll receive training and have access to a network of coaches for support. You'll initially meet with the participants within the first three months of the scheme, then deliver six to eight career coaching sessions over the two year period. Along the journey, you'll help participants to put what they've learnt into practice and to reflect on their progress. We're looking for people who've previously coached staff at a senior level or have other relevant experience, who are ILM5 qualified or equivalent, and share our commitment to promoting equality, diversity and inclusion. You may find the role rewarding for a wide variety of reasons. You can put your coaching skills into practice. I've been a coach for a number of years and I've been a qualified coach for five years now. I just thought that the HPS gave me a real opportunity to develop my coaching skills. This appealed because it was um, a different form of coaching rather than it being around performance. This was around career coaching and for a coach to be able to support participants through being becoming compassionate leaders for me that that was the appeal so i was interested in becoming a high potential scheme coach for a number of reasons really i've become a qualified coach and i was very keen in developing other people but more importantly being part of developing the new leadership you know the need for different leadership styles really interested me you can get access to training and connect with a network of coaches. I've taken a coaching approach um, through my work for quite a bit of time, but actually having formal coaching relationships, I haven't had very many at all. And I certainly feel that having sort of stuck my neck out of it and said, go on, I'll give it a go. I've um, benefited from that in terms of my confidence, but also the access that I've had to supervision to CPD and therefore learning more um, about coaching as I've gone along and that's been really valuable and the quality of the, the supervision and the CPD has been excellent. And you'll help participants to grow both personally and professionally. What I've been able to do is to work through with my participant some of the um, psychometric testing results, what does that actually mean in reality, providing that soundboard um, and that listening ear for her to formulate a more comprehensive understanding of herself and what she wants in her strength and her developments as a leader. It's been a, an absolute privilege and an honour to be part of somebody's journey and to witness and observe their own growth and achievements and not just professional development but in their own personal development and that self-awareness. I think the other thing that really drew me was that the programme itself was looking to select people with real potential to be the leaders of the future NHS and it was a really exciting uh, proposition to coach those individuals on their development journey. To learn more about becoming a careers coach and other roles at the High Potential Scheme, please contact your integrated care system, Leadership and High Potential Lead.